what? How many ad breaks are on this? Well, 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 it seems the cat's out of the bag. Today, I'm going to discuss to you why I'm a fraud and the future of this channel. So why am I making this video? Number one, this is my non-technical video. So if you don't want to stick here for that, then you can just wait for the next technical video. Second, uh, this is a channel update video. So we're not only going to go over how I've defrauded you, how I've cheated you, how I've bamboozled you, but we're also going to go over what's going to happen in the future of this channel. Now that my secret is up, the jig is up, the, the con is over. It's time to go mask off and reveal what we've been hiding all this time. But first, I want to give a shout out to everyone out there before uh, I get into that. Here we go. Because of you guys, because of you guys, I was able to get to 1481 subs. And I got to say, you got to give yourself an applause for that. Thank you, guys. I love you. You hear that? I, I think, I hope you do, at least. You know. uh, thank you very much for that 1400 subscribers. And we're going to go over the most important statistic now. Uh, go over here. Go to audience. Go down here. Aha. We have 0.2% female audience and 99.8% male audience. Congratulations, guys. That's about eight uh, women in this channel. Eight females. Good job. Good job, guys. We have just as much uh, ratio here to male to female ratio as like any other red pill uh, male centric channel slash uh, M Magic the Gathering slash uh, NFT scam artist channel so thank you i'm in the league of those people Woo! and not only that let's go over the other stuff that's happening because of you the 1481 uh stuff here 1481 people you need a thousand to get to monetization but you also need four thousand dollars which we've reached last week and youtube has officially put me in the youtube partnership program now i have this uh little tab that says my estimate revenue and I have made a buck 34 in the last day, I believe a buck 34. Yeah, boy, Monday, September the 5th and today's the 7th. So maybe three bucks. Let's look at the revenue here. Now, if you guys know anything about these numbers, let me know because I actually don't know what this means, but I'm pretty sure that the number I care about the most is this one right here. So according to this, I have made roughly a buck 34 because uh, the other numbers haven't come in yet. So. And I don't know what this means. I've read it and then I glazed over it and I, I didn't care anymore. Nice. <laughs> I have no idea what this means. It's just 20 bucks, but it's not here. So I don't care much about this thing, I guess. So F that. But we're going to go over some other stuff here. And uh, yeah, so I guess the other thing is going to be news uh, ads are going to be in the channel. So if we go to the editor. You'll see I got ad breaks here. And according to this, there are, what the, f what? How many ad breaks are on this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. There are 20 ad breaks on this. Holy crap. What the, f whoa. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want 20. This is a three hour video. Uh, but 20 seems a bit much. Like, I was hoping, like, what, what's one out of 10, one every 10 minutes, more or less? I don't want them to be so close to each other. I'm just going to get rid of a few of them. Like, at least, like, 10 minutes apart, because this is a real... Oh, I shouldn't curse. <laughs> I'm getting rid of that. Get rid of that. Uh, get rid of that. Get rid of the first one. What the hell? The first three minutes? Uh, uh, I want them to at least be 10 minutes apart. Sorry, guys. You're looking for some behind the things thing, but uh, well, yeah, it's fine. 10 minutes. Roughly 10 minutes. Uh, and I can't really put them in non disruptive parts because I've edited out all the parts that I could do it. So I'm just going to leave it there. That's about every 10 minutes. Because my goodness, my goodness, there are a lot of ads on this one. That's three hours. But I think uh, for my normal videos, I normally don't do three hour videos. For the normal ones, like like if I do like a tutorial one, they'll be about uh, between 20 minutes and, and longer. Uh, if I go to here, for my ad breaks, yeah, four. That's not horrible for 46 minutes. That's every 10 minutes, which I think is decent. 
Uh, yeah, whatever. But my goodness, they put like I remember that one I edited before doing this, and that one had seven. So they were going crazy with the ads. Anyways, you're gonna be seeing ads <laughs> on the videos from now on, and hopefully that makes me some moolah. But yeah, I just removed a few of those. Like, that was egregious. I think that once every 10 minutes is probably a decent amount of time. That used to be the old. In case you don't know, YouTube had a 10-minute limit. And that used to be how it was. So you had one ad in there somewhere. Ah, it's good, 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 good. I don't know. There's nothing really uh, else here that's uh, of note, I guess. Uh, uh, watch this video. Give me more of that. Click through, right? I don't know, I guess. But it's doing pretty well overall. And I think everything else is doing pretty well overall. I don't know. I, I know I've lost a little bit of track here. Uh, I, I guess uh, let me sh show this real quick. If you guys don't know, I do have a I post stuff all the time, and this is how I get feedback from you. I'm, I'm this is really important to me. This one right here specifically, because I'm a lot of people came from Razor. Webforms was really different to me. Like, you, there was a lot of people from Webforms. It's kind of crazy. And there's 2% React. And that React video was like uh, a pretty decent video for my channel. So I'm very surprised that there was such an overlap. I might try an Angular one next. You know, I don't know. Well, maybe, maybe we'll make a poll about it and you'll see. But I do want to do at least a video that's like uh, more catered to you guys. I don't know what you guys want for a video. Uh, this is more of the uh, my channel update video. It's kind of like the other one back in the past when I did when Elden Ring came out in February. And I played, I don't know how many hours, but ugh, that was crazy. Ugh, sorry about that. Sorry about that. But anyways, yeah, this is getting a little crazy, a little ranty. But I am very excited for the channel, and I thank you very much wholeheartedly. The next thing I'm going to do is actually uh, try to leverage uh, the channel more and actually make more money off of it if possible. So I expect that to come down the line. Yes, I know. It's pretty uh, selfish, but the whole point of the channel was to make it into a business anyway. And I've been trying very, very hard to do so. I do want to be an entrepreneur, like, you know, and sustain myself, all that good stuff. But the next thing to come down the pipeline is actually my website. So I used to have a website, in case you don't know, that I usually advertise down in the description to do free sessions with me. I'm going to move that over to a different website that is for just Blazor. So that's going to have some stuff there. And then later on, or, you know, maybe at the same time, I start opening up my own GitHub stuff. I know you've been asking for that, and I keep, you know, just not doing it because I hate you. I'm kidding. Uh, but, um, but no, it's just, it's just a timing thing. Like it really does take a long time to make, like, I, I want to make my videos good. And then if I want to make them short and good, it takes even more time. I don't know if you know the adage of, uh, um, if I had more time, I would have written a short letter, something like that. It's, it is true. Like I, if I want to make something more concise and, and better, I do have to take more time to make it. And it's actually easier to make longer videos and, and then more rewarding actually, to be fair. But I do like to, my format of keeping things as short as possible about teaching you the specific thing you want to know. But as we go forward, we're probably going to be leaning into more longer videos and longer tutorials, which might be good for you if you want to see an actual big uh, tutorial that you can combine all the parts that you've learned from the other ones. So look out for that. Apart from, from apart from the new website is going to come out uh, on the website, I'm actually going to have a little uh, a free gift, I guess, free because I'm going to do an email list later on. But uh, it is it's not it doesn't cost me anything. It is an actual cheat sheet that I'm making for Blazor. So stay tuned for that. The cheat sheet is actually done. I just need to do the website. So I will be posting all that up uh, once it's all done and put it on my site. Uh, put it on the YouTube, tell you where to go if you want to get it, and then just uh, advertise it like I do with the other one, uh, but maybe a little bit more. So apart from the ads, apart from my new website, apart from you know the whole thing is a business adventure uh, that that you know we just begun basically. Since uh, we have some uh, actual funding coming in, you know, buck thirty-four. That's forty bucks a month, if you know what I mean. What can we do with forty bucks a month? I don't know. Maybe spend it for one gallon of gas in the if you're from the U.S. <laughs> I get you. Trust me. I'm from. I'm. I'm in Europe. The gas here is even higher than what you you think is over there. You think over there is crazy? You come over here. And tell me how much you're gonna pay for a liter of gas. Guess how it is over here. Anyways, um, apart from all that. Am I a fraud? Nah, that's up to you, to be honest. I don't think I am because I actually do put a lot of effort in my Blazor stuff and I do take a lot of information from every source because I think Microsoft uh, is a decent source of information, but it's really annoying to read. It's, it's just like, you know, they could make it easier to read. But then I guess without that, then there would be channels like mine trying to decipher everything, put it in a nice, like, much easier to read package for people out there. 
I've also been contemplating doing um, videos specific to going from one technology to another. So let's say you were doing, like, let's say a web form video, uh, that you were from web forms, and uh, I could show you, you know, different concepts that are similar in Blazor to what you're used to in web forms. So you have the whole uh, contextual understanding uh, so it's not as big of a shock to you when you move from one to the other um and maybe for other stuff too i've been contemplating doing that i just haven't really uh dug into how to do it but i think that is really i think that'd be very interesting but you let me know uh in the description or whatever anyways uh, i don't know if there's gonna be ads in this video i will remove ads um so that's only up to like every 10 minutes or so so i only want to really have one ad if it's like 10 minutes long but I can't control. I can't control whether it's a first ad or not. Like that's not me. I can only control the ads that are within the video, and uh, and I'm keeping them the uh, ten minutes interval more or less. So I know it's like a little bit annoying to watch them, but please keep supporting the channel because I want to keep giving you more content. Eventually, I would like to branch out to more things and have other revenue sources as well. Right now, we're just beginning the journey, and I want you to keep on that journey with me because you've served me this far and I would like to keep giving you more value and more content as we go along further. And I also believe that Blazor is for the future and that's why I'm gonna continue working on the Blazor channel. So that has not changed. And as far as my own expertise, um, I don't know, the, 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 the thumbnail was clickbaity. I don't think I'm a fraud at least. Like if you find where I am a fraud, you know, please tell me where. That was just a beam for me. Because I, it looks so cool. I like the thumbnail. It looked really good. I like that. I, I thought it was cool at least. I don't know. I'm ranting now. But um, yeah. Anyways, anyhow, any, let me go back to Big Me so I can give you kisses and hugs and all that stuff. So my audience out there in the Just Blazer community, I thank you very much for allowing me to get to the point where I could have a YouTube partnership in the first place. It doesn't matter what money it makes there because it's not going to make much money. Like, let's be real. This is not one of those channels that can make that much money through the ad revenue alone. There's no way. If I want to make money, you have to do other stuff, which I am trying to do. So I'm not going to you know, hide my intentions there that I am trying to make a business out of this at some point in time. But it's going to take a lot more time. Like, it, it is. it takes years to, to do anything and to make any of strives but in the meantime i want to still give you more value more content so please keep up with me let me know what you want me you want to see from me and always make sure to tell me what i can do better in the channels i know some of you have pointed out some technical stuff that i've done wrong and i like that feedback because it makes me think and how to better myself as a programmer overall it's really really good and uh the only time i really remove comments is if um i see like it's spam or it's a bot or or if i don't understand what you're saying and then i'm like Ugh. I don't want to deal with this, so oof. But if you criticize me or you give me constructive criticism, I will genuinely, you know, I, I, I would appreciate it. I want to be a better person. I want to be a better programmer. And I want to make better videos for you overall. And I think it's a good lesson if you if you know what you're talking about, at least. Now, anyways, anyway, anyhow, here's Blazor Programming is out. I'm going to, I don't know what I'm going to do now. Look at all that money I'm making. I would bug 34 every day. A bug to do fours every day. I could almost buy a candy bar. Two days I could buy one candy bar. I love candy. Let's see. Uh, uh, uh.